Ms. Rucker gave us the wagon wheel, and now Baltimore has the water wheel. New technology to solve an age-old problem of collecting our trash in the harbor, and that last rainstorm we had, that's about as nasty as it gets. It was so bad that Healthy Harbor Baltimore flunked the harbor, gave it an F rating for trash. And the Federal Clean Water Act, not a big fan of us, the wheel is powered by the current as well as solar panels. There are booms attached to the wheel that guide the trash into the conveyor. The conveyor then carries the trash directly into a floating dumpster. City and business leaders hope that eventually the wheel will be uh, an effective, so effective that it won't even be needed. It's so often from people who just drop litter and have bad behavior and bad habits that cause this problem. The hope, though, for the future is that we can put the wheel out of business. And the greatest opportunity to do that is through our children who don't have bad habits and don't have bad behaviors yet. And the city tested a similar water wheel prototype about seven years ago. In three months, it took 100,000 pounds of trash out of the harbor. The firm that built both wheels say this new model is bigger and stronger than the earlier version. And we showed you just a few of the pictures of the harbor trashed after recent flooding. And you can see the rest of the photos from Healthy Harbor on our website. Find them in the photo gallery section right there on abc2news.com. Michael Masco, that was disgusting. That was nasty terrible. to see the harbor the way it was. <laughs> terrible, huh? terrible. And the algae bloom will start going as we get warm, too. So that's another issue.